Hey guys, I'm Keely, and today I'm going to be sharing my testimony with you guys. Um, so I'm not completely comfortable sharing my entire testimony um, with people I don't know yet. Um, so I'm going to kind of just do like the short and sweet version of it. So I grew up in church. Um, both my parents are Christians. Um, I always knew who God was. Um, I got baptized and accepted Christ at the age of eight. Um, like I said, I had like I knew who God was, but I didn't really have the full concept of it. Um, so like there wasn't really a change in my life and stuff. Um, at the age of 13, I rededicated my life to Christ. Um, and I really started making changes. I started reading God's word. I started praying. I started um, paying attention in church and um, going to the youth group on Wednesday nights. Um, and I really loved it. And I was like, I was wanting to know who God was. Um, and it was great. Um, and then, um, so through middle school was kind of that period in time of when I was just like wanting to know more about Christ. Um, I was forming that relationship with him. Um, and by like the end of eighth grade, ninth grade, um, I considered like, and I thought that I had a really good relationship with Christ. Um, and then the summer before 10th grade, um, I went through the hardest thing that I've ever had to go through in my life. Um, and that was really a test of my faith. Um, and during that time, I really um, sought after God. I was in his word, I was praying, um, I was having um, friends and um, like Sunday school teachers and stuff um, really just um, like pour wisdom and knowledge and encouragement into me, um, and during that time, I really kind of like pushed everybody away, um, in a sense, um, I didn't want to talk to anybody during that time. Um, I just wanted to be alone. Um, and because like, I didn't want to share what I was going through with other people. That just wasn't something that I was used to doing. Um, and so, yeah, like I said, I really started just like, um, running to God and seeking after him and finding comfort in him. Um, and then in 10th grade and like, like through that year, um, I really relied um, and leaned on friends and family more um and then once I was able to just um get to the point where I was comfortable with sharing with other people how I was feeling um it was like a weight was lifted off my shoulders and that really really helped me um that was how I was able to get through it it's just like spending time with God, but also talking to people who are trusted, um, and so, um, God delivered me out of that, um, and, and my family, um, and things are a lot better now, um, but again, like during that time, I was really had to trust him because that was like the only thing I could do. Um, I, I just, I felt helpless and hopeless and like I couldn't do anything. 
Um, so I just had to fully surrender it to God, give it to Him, and just trust Him. Um, and now I just try to continue to trust God, um, continue to have faith, um, and yeah. So. And I can definitely say that, um, you know, I didn't, I didn't know that my relationship with God could grow anymore in the way that it did. Um, and it, it has, it has grown tremendously and I'm so thankful for that. Um, and now like when I'm going through something hard, I just remember who God is, how great he is. Um, I remember how he, um, he brought me and my family through that hard time and he's, he's always with me. Um, so that's really what I hold on to and that's what helps me get through everything. Um, so yeah, um, that's my testimony. <laughs>